Welcome back, everyone, to the next installment of Dark Souls 2. We are in the Dragon's Sanctum, and this place doesn't mess around. Not one bit. Ugh, it's creepy every time. It really is. I did just use a bonfire, so this guy's back. Fortunately, he's a fool and wishes to attack from afar. There we go. I feel just a bit better already. Now we are going to, instead of, um, instead of going to where we originally went when we were running in a panic with Jester Thomas, I am instead going to retreat to where we first came from. Not this way, this is the end of the path. I want to deal with the beginning of the path. Hey guys, look at these spikes. Spikes that you can walk on and be hurt by now. Not that it hurts very much. I really, like, I don't understand why spikes are a thing in this game. They barely do anything. I don't know, these guys are kind of dumbasses. Well, at least he's out of my way. We've mostly explored that section of the dungeon. See, the thing is... What comes after is the boss area. But I want to take a look at the, uh, the other place. So let's get a load of it, if I can. Oh wow, didn't even hit the bug. Oh, that's interesting. It, like, it was attracted to the sound of my shot, I guess. God, everything is gross. Anything to shut these things up, am I right? I guess I'm just gonna have to jump down there and deal with it. Oh, whoa, hi! I almost died, what? What even is this? How are you okay? Wow, how are you even... I mean, I had only a sliver of health left for those guys, but... Who knew that they could deal that much damage? I know I'm in the DLC area, but they're freaking bugs. Too bad they're not actually attracted to it. Oh, that guy comes running? Sure, why not? Now we're talking. That's much more like it. Are you kidding me? There we go. Now I'm a little less likely to be uh, killed by cheap shots. Boom. Alright, where do the enemies come from? Oh, I see. Everywhere. That Jesus, no wonder I am I died. And now I'm gonna need repair powder or something. How many of you idiots are there? I'm gonna die again. Are you serious? It amazes me that they just have okay. Oh, it amazes me that they could just keep the corrosion on. Like, isn't that cheating? Like, turn it off! Get the hell out of here! God damn. I'll use this on principle. There. Now I'll come running, I assume. 
Old growth bomb. Hooray for me. Take your sweet time, buddy. It's fine. I'll, I'll be over here. It's cool. Boom. You are out of here, buddy. Disgusting. And just for safety. I don't know if I'm even going to come back to this room again. But this stuff does not need to exist. I'm glad I bought freaking 300 arrows. I'm using a bunch. Oh, uh, whoops. Alright. What's the last item here? 10 dung pies. Well, that's just great. What else is around here? 20 poison throwing knives. That's that's quite the amount. Okay, a ladder. Was this worth it? Flynn's Ring. That's a new one. Ring of Flynn, the infamous thief. Utilizes the strength of the wind, such that lower equip load proportionally increases physical attack. Whoa. So if I were actually a good Dark Souls player and I had the lightest armor for best rolls, my physical attack would be crazy. Flynn was known as a tiny fighter who packed a mighty punch. Even the most skilled warriors in the land failed to capture him. Interesting. Yeah, do I just drop there? Oh. No, we're back. But who is singing the- oh, oh, that's a dick move. I didn't even take that into account. Well, this guy's gonna be an idiot, then I'll just, uh, do this. Whoop! Man, this guy's dumb. Alright. Oh, for God's sake. I keep forgetting there were two sorceresses. Yeah, right on the bridge. There's my problem. That, what the hell? Oh, God. I deserve that. I just stayed there for that. Freaking toxic sorceresses, but she actually dropped something this time. Oh, a dragon charm. Ugh. All right. Okay. Guess we'll just do this. got this guy down here. Hello, buddy. Goodbye, buddy. Always feels good to get rid of those guys. Now a new area. Alright, this is just a dead end. That's right, was this the jester? Oh no, this is where this is on the way to the jester. I was frantically running away and didn't have time to pick up this item, which is just an old growth bomb, so that's great. But Jester Thomas wasn't far from here, was he? Okay, there we go. Hey pal. Gee, okay. You know what? I'm not gonna die today. 
cool, 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 cool. That almost hurt. Right, that's how I died last time. I tried peeking around the wall, but nope, he just threw down the hallway. Alright, now we can fight a little better. I like to think. Oh my god. Thank you, generally good against fire, Hevel Shield. What do you even want from me with this guy? This guy's pretty over the top. Did I hit? I don't even think I hit him. This guy is more frustrating than I thought he would be. Gotta say. Yeah, that's a hit. 400 damage did that little to him, by the way. Of his overall health. Oh, I'm gonna die. Let's, uh, let's hide. That lingering flame is gonna be the death of me. Do do do. Good. Thank you, Hebel Armor. This guy has too much health. I would love to be able to backstab him. Also, did he use like flash sweat or something? He 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 has some sort of effect on him right now. I don't know. Get 282, that's not the damage I used to do. This guy hurts, what the hell? Get down here, please. Man, I couldn't see for a second there. This guy is over the top. Here's an idea. Oh, that, that was not what I wanted to do. I wanted to do the jump attack, if I could. I hope this guy doesn't test us. There it is. That hurt. And it threw him off his game for just a second. Wait, what the hell? Why did I heal? Was that just an area of effect healing ability? Why am I heal- Like, why would he cast that? It was just like... I guess it's healing him too if he steps in it, but... That was weird. Now I'm gonna die. I'm gonna go somewhere else right now. Oh man. This guy is too much. What is with these weird... Okay. Thank you. That was more effort than I thought it was going to be. Huh. I, I really don't understand why that, that healing thing is here. Like, I'll take it, but it's just, it's weird that it exists. I don't freaking know. I don't know. Well, see ya. Right, so this is where we actually met Jester Thomas. And here we go. What am I, in water? I guess Sunken City. Whoa. Whoa, whoa. T-Rex? There's more than one. There, there are at least three. Alright, here's a stupid thing to ask. What happens if I do this? You can't run, can you? You can't run, can you? <gasps> what? 
wait, really? Man, I, I actually figured he would run, but I didn't think he would just... Wow, that's fast. How am I going to deal with this? And the funny thing is, there should be a bonfire past these guys. Oh, I hit two of them. Good. Great. These things are actually scary. You cannot come in here. God, they look kind of small because they're far away, but like, no, they're, they're not that small. <laughs> Whoa. Okay. That's such a weird thing for them to be able to do. I really thought they would just run up and bite me. I'm gonna heal now. See, what gets me nervous is, like I said, there should be a bonfire past them. The thing is, Jester Thomas is dead. I'm not gonna have to go through that ordeal again. But it would just be nice to get rid of these guys. God, freaky monsters. I'm just lucky that one attack happened to miss me. And that was just a stupid shot. Also, is it me or do they have... Wow. Is it me or do they have human-looking teeth? Like, those did not look like triangular teeth. Which makes these things way more creepy. And gross. Well, I got one of them. Ugh. The blast on that thing, too. The blast radius is ridiculous. There's no way I'm fighting these things straight. I did not think that that would go in my direction. Ow. I really thought that he was going to hit the, the obstacles with that. Too bad for me. Keep it coming. God, these things really are just gross. And there was definitely another one of them. That's the thing that really bothers me. Like, there is clearly... What the hell did you just hit? Yeah, there's the third. Okay, I can just run. So that's good. I'm curious. Is this the lower area where I saw these things walking around when I first entered the DLC area? Because that'd be kind of clever. Can I fight these things? Oh, God. Mm hmm. I don't know about this, man. Let's not aggro the friend. Jesus. What a fr- Whoa, okay. For real, what are you? For real. Oh. No. God, no. Do you stomp by any chance, sir? Oh, what an actual terror. That was a lot of stamina. You have health. And you do stomp. What the? That's a thing you can do? Oh my god. 
I can't even afford to combo this guy. See? Oh, I should have died. God, that was scary. That was actually scary. What a terror. There's definitely one more. And I don't even know where it is. And I believe that's the bonfire, by the way. If I can reach that, that'd be neato. There's an item that way. There's two more, for God's sake. Petrified Dragon Bone times three, that's pretty cool. There's an item, there's the bonfire. There's another item over here. Human Effigy times three, nifty. There's another item. Good God. Dried Root times two, don't really care. I think an encounter is mandatory now. What an actually scary design. It's got no eyes as far as I can tell, like freaking alien. Ho 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 ho. Once again, thank you game for allowing me to target specific body parts. Oh, this thing's freaking me out. I should have been in real trouble right there. No. Please don't kill me. Oh, thank God. Oh, I mean, what am I going to do when a freaking Tyrannosaur just jumps in the air? What do you expect me to do? Boop. God, what a freaking nightmare monster. I'm actually curious if these things stay dead when killed. I didn't even try to attack. Oh, okay. I didn't even try to attack him because I just wanted to make sure that my stamina came back. There, a little love tap on the leg. That was stupid. Or was it? Oh, thank God. What a freaking nightmare. Oh, these creatures are terrible. I think that's where I actually need to go. But I am clearly going the bonfire route. I think this area is actually clear now. Which would greatly please me, by the way. This area is terrifying. Soul of a great hero. Thank you. Thank you. That might be it. Alright, now for the moment of truth. Do they... They do. Nifty. Oh, by the way. Ah, Lair of the Imperfect. Yeah, they're all just back. Ugh. What are you and why are you? Like, how did you even come to be? What is your purpose? Easy does it. Oh, wow. Yep, not much I can do about that. He just jumps on me. You, sir, are out of here. I wonder if they drop anything. Wouldn't that be interesting? Oh, come on. I have to get past that far one. 
And I don't think I'm going to outrun it. Like, are you kidding? I'm happy I got the bonfire, but like, what? what is this? What is this? What do I even do about this situation? I think that approaching this guy is actually really stupid. Oh, it's over. But I got away from his friend. Oh my god, he just books it. Are you freaking serious, that hit? What a blast zone. God, imagine getting eaten by this thing. You don't need that in your life. Uh-oh. Well, that's what that's like. I got greedy and I paid for it. Well, I'm using two Estus flasks, so I'm like, just regular-ass anime. Regular-ish. Crunch. One hit is enough for this guy, I think. That's what I want. I can't believe these guys freaking respawn. I can hardly believe it. So there's the last one. What should be the last one? God damn. One hit is enough. Uh oh. I deserve that. I really do. Ugh. The sounds from this guy. Crunch. And now he's over here. Great. I really don't like this thing. Oh, I think I just got myself into trouble. Maybe not, maybe not. Good. Thought I got myself kills, but not quite. Good. It actually drops? Oh, they just drop petrified dragon bones. That's pretty cool. Wow. I guess it's DLC, why not, here. Have have just a regular enemy drop this now. Can I reach that? Like, that, that water is death, but what's that sparkly? I don't know what that is. Anyway, going up. Alright, the stairs has this, and then there's a tunnel over there. Huh. Maybe the sparkle is just a trick of the light? I don't freaking know. Well, let's take a look at the quick dead end thing on the pedestal, right? Oh, the dragon stone. Sure. Oh, so maybe there was something to that sparkly after all. That was really cool. That's probably useful for going into this cave. Would not be surprised. Now let's hop on in. Oh god, more of these pillar things. Drake Blood Greatsword. Great sword wielded by the Drake Blood Knights, led by the Honorable Sir Yorg. The insignia chiseled upon its hilt symbolizes dragon's blood. 
To the Drake Blood Knights, fresh dragon blood was sacrosanct. They believed that by obtaining it, they could achieve a true understanding of life, transcending their own banal existence. It's kind of cool. Alright. Well, this was a dead end, so I guess I have to go back. Now I guess we do this, right? Oh. So that pillar just stays down. I just turn this thing on and that's it. Okay, good. There we go. There's that bridge I made. So if I'd gone here first, I'd have had to go back in and look for the dragon stone, I suppose. Also, I think this ought to be good. This is not where I want to go to, but... That is a super shortcut. Look at that. The first bonfire in the DLC. That is freaking cool. I gotta say, there wasn't so much of this in the base game. Bonfires are more checkpoints than anything else. Except for, like, in the Undead Asylum or something. Or the Undead uh, Crypt. So it's actually nice to see that the DLC is bringing back the idea of... You opened a shortcut, now go back to the first bonfire. That, that's kind of refreshing. Alright, now we're here with the big uh, with the big bridge that we can cross. So I think I'll go a little bit further. Oh, hello. Human effigy. Eh. <laughs> I was down there. You could barely see it. Dragon Sanctum, we're back. Surprise, surprise. I wonder if I should go this way. Okay, that was easy. Less easy. What is that? That massive glowy down there. It looks like, I guess it's a, a mist door. Okay. I could probably hop there easily enough. Yeah, that's where I'm going. Okay. We're getting closer. The fall will still probably kill me, but we are getting closer. And there's more of that singing. Oh, what the? I'm sorry, who the hell are you? Other than a talented fighter? Like, who are you? And this looks like a unique encounter. I can't promise that, but it looks like... Okay? It looks like a unique encounter. I don't know. And I'm a little afraid to step on these buttons. Although I think they're... Jesus. I think the buttons just, like, rotate the wall or something, but still. Whew! Let's, let's go back inside.
better know damn well what you're doing when you're two-handing a sword, you know? Your defense is garbage at that point. Well, you're out of here, whoever the hell you were. Jeez. Oof. Well, I can't recover from that, but it looks like I don't need to anyway. That is a fall. Where am I? What's going on? Ten hexing urns? Okay. Really? I thought that was like some sort of weird, unique encounter. I guess it's just an enemy type? Ah, crap. I like that he also can't really roll. Oh, that was stupid. Alright, we're good. Oh, you're gonna heal? You tried. A for effort. Jeez. Ooh, I don't know. Yeah, it just loops around. I guess I have to. I think we're almost there. Oh, go away. Come on. Oh, I was really hoping I would knock him out of whatever he was doing. But I got that backstab in, so that feels great. Okay. Doing it. You know what? I think I missed something somewhere. There. How the hell do you expect me to find this? Unfortunately, I'm going to respawn that enemy because I'm going to sit here. But we're in the Sanctum Interior. Well, that feels pretty good. Normally, I would stop here. It's being it's about that time. But I think I'm actually right before a boss. So I'll at least give it a token effort. Got to fight this jerk again, unfortunately. God, that's cool. Damn. Wow, no mercy. Okay. Calm down there, buddy. get a little more health out there. Whoa. Hi. Alright, I think I'll play this fight a little more straight. Damn, this guy's quite spry. Except for that part. That was actually really clumsy. That was pretty good. I was hoping for a backstab, but can't always get what you want. There we go. Just allow me to do it. Thanks, buddy. Pain in the ass. I guess it's just death down there. So perhaps I'm about the furthest down I'm allowed to go?
open chests. That's a little weird. Drake blood set. Black Helm of the Drake Blood Knights, who came from a land long forgotten. The Drake Blood Knights, who worshipped the blood of dragons, were led by Sir Yorg in a siege of the Eternal Sanctum, but sunk into the Sanctum when the slumbering dragon awoke. The red cloth wrapped around their black armor represents the sacred blood of dragons. Okay. Ah, oh, okay. So those are who, who I've been killing. I've been killing actual Drake Blood Knights. Yeah, I like the part. Except for the shield, of course. Back to my heavy self. Who can hardly roll to save his life. Wait, am I allowed to actually go down there? Now I'm getting confused. And I'm a little nervous because I might need to make a jump and that did not look reasonable. I think I have no choice though, which is really bad. There's no way. Unless I can land that way. Oh my god. That's a little nerve-wracking. Hang on. Oh, wow, that's bad. Okay, only one of them activated. Thank God. That actually could have been really awful. Let's just make sure his friend doesn't show up. Ah, crap. That turnaround attack, though. It's not good. There we go. There's no way they can double team me now. Vine bomb? Oh, dexterity. Good for archery, I guess. Twinkling Titanite again. I could really upgrade my armor now. I really hate it when they can just absorb attacks. It's ridiculous. I really love that enemies know how to guard break, but they don't know how to follow it up, with like very few exceptions. Ah, oh, thank god. One or two more hits. One. Good, good, good. Got me nervous. Alright, what do I get as a reward? Large soul of a brave warrior. Twinkling Titanite again. This is a lot. Wow, really? Small, smooth, and silky stone. Hooray. But no, this is, this is really good, actually. Oh, there's a summon sign over there? I believe I'm gonna want that. Now, how do I get down without killing myself? Okay. That's how. Dragon's Rest. Well, this is intimidating. And there are multiple summon signs. Ben Hart, hey, my man. Mr. Fake. Moonlight Sword. It's still a Moonlight Sword, I guess. And who's the other one? 
Did I see things? Was I seeing things? Were there, were there two summon signs or were there somehow three? No, I guess it's, it's, it's two, but still, it's a lot. Steelheart Ellie. Well, I don't know you that well. And let's summon Ben Hart first, just so I can give him something to do to go find me. And then I'll go back, and I'll summon Ellie. Good, here we go. Steelheart Ellie. Let's make this happen. Where is Ben Hart? There we go. And here's Ellie. Take your time, Benhard. I'm gonna move against the fog gate to see if I can get them to get a little closer. Good, let's go. Super Sorceress? That dragon. That's badass. That's... Okay. Hey, Phantoms, were you gonna do anything? Not really? Okay. What? Whoa. Oh, that's bad. These Phantoms are freaking weak. What the hell is this? Oh, what? Skeletons? Uh-oh. Yeah, I do not want to get hit by a hundred dark spells. I'm going to leave the skeletons alone for now. I love how after all this, she's at like half. Most bosses would have been dead by now, but not her. Or not she. Oh, that's bad. That hurt. Yes, please, attack the phantoms. Oh, that's her homing little option attack. And more skeletons, cool, thanks. Oh, Ellie's gonna die. I really don't want the phantoms to die because then she'll concentrate on me. And not only will she concentrate on me, but it's just fewer people hurting her. <laughs> oh my god. Excuse me while I heal. I gotta just hope that she's attacking the Phantom. Benhart's gonna die, so I really gotta get in there. I'm actually almost done. I just gotta make sure that the uh, the final attacks oh, ho, 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 do their duty. We almost got her. Please do not kill. Oh, Benhart's gonna die. Quickly, 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 quickly! That was close. And Ben Hart even lived. Soul of Ilana, Squalid Queen. Oh, damn. That's cool. Whew. The Dark Soul is like all, you know, dark. I'm good with I'm good with language. Soul of Ilana, the squalid queen, who rests beside the slumbering dragon of the eternal sanctum. This child of dark accompanies the dragon, slowly amassing souls in anticipation of the coming day of vengeance. The wondrous soul of this augur of wrath can be used to acquire numerous souls or create something to with. Okay. That's probably even the next thing I do is convert this soul into something.
Wait, what? I immediately get two summons. Is there a boss right past this boss? I just, I'm just given summons by the bonfire. Transcendent Ed, Eddie? Abbess Fever, interesting. You know, I'm curious. If I reset the area with this bonfire, would I be allowed to summon four phantoms? That's what I'm curious about. In any case, that was a lot all at once, so for now it is time to stop the installment. Well, we certainly made a lot of progress today, didn't we? We made it to a boss of the Sunken King DLC, and it looks like there's another boss right behind her. It said that she was hanging out with the dragon, so maybe the dragon Sin is the next boss? That sure would be interesting. Until next time, everyone.